So, you're debating between Nespresso Virtual Next VS Plus, both machines look similar, but they have significant differences. The Virtual Plus has an automatic open for pods and a rotating water tank, while the Virtual Next can brew an 18 oz craft coffee and has Wi-Fi connectivity. My overall vote goes to the Virtual Plus because of the convenient tank and slightly better value. The Virtual Next is a good option if you want the 18 oz carafe option and the latest technology. However, some Nespresso aficionados had issues with the Virtual Next, which I'll address in this article. I bought and used both of these Nespresso machines, so I'll dive into Nespresso Next VS, plus similarities and differences, so you can decide which Nespresso Virtual machine is better for you. The most important feature is to compare the different designs and programmability between the two machines. The Virtual Plus came out first in 2017, and Virtual Next followed in 2020, so Next has a somewhat more modern design. Keep in mind that there are design differences between the Long High and Breville machines for each model, where Breville has a rounded top on the Virtual Plus and different colors on the Virtual Next. In general, Nespresso machines have a compact size that doesn't take up too much space, which is also the case with Virtual Next and Plus. All the key components are located at the front, so it's easy to use, clean, and maintain the coffee maker. That being said, Virtual Next is a newer model, so it has a more modern design compared to Plus. Virtual Next comes with a larger brewing chamber, which is wider at the top and slimmer below. But the water tank pays the price for this, it's 37 oz compared to 40 oz for the plus. Here's how these espresso machines compare in terms of size and weight. Virtual Plus is wider than Virtual Next. The height is the same, 16.8 inches. Virtual Next weighs 8.8 .8 pounds, while Plus weighs 9.7 pounds. Both coffee machines are made of plastic, which is to be expected considering the affordable price of Nespresso coffee machines. One difference is that Nespresso use 54% recycled plastic in manufacturing Virtual Next, so it's a good option if you're concerned about the environmental impact. I want to address one issue. There are many reports that the Virtual Next leaks water. I noticed this on social media including Facebook and Reddit. Even on Nespresso's own website there's a big discrepancy in user ratings. The Virtual Plus is rated 4.6 while Virtual Next is 3.0, the lowest of the line of it. Lastly, there have been an oddly high number of used Virtual Next for sale on my local apps. To be clear, I didn't have issues with the Virtual Next bill, and I think it's durable but it's only been a few weeks. I want to point out the leak issue because it's come up enough that Craft Coffee Spot readers should be aware before choosing. The opening system for the machine head is another large difference between the two machines, where the Plus is automatic while the next is manual. Virtual Plus has a motorized lid to open the machine head. All you need to do is gently push up the lever, and the top opens up. You place the pot inside and then tap the lever down for the head to close. You'll hear it poke the pot and that's all you need. Virtual Plus has a 40 oz adjustable water tank, which can rotate to the side or back of the machine. This design makes it easy to fill the tank and fit on a narrow countertop. Keep in mind that the water tank is 3.5 inches, so factor that space into the side or back of dimensions when considering the size. Nespresso Virtual Machines use centrifusion technology, which spins the capsule 7,000 times per minute to blend the coffee and hot water for a delicious end result. When it comes to coffee brewing, both coffee machines can make a single cup of coffee in about 25 seconds from inserting the pot until the coffee maker starts brewing. Overall, you won't wait for more than a minute for your coffee to be ready. The Virtuo Next has a louder pump than the Plus. Running the Next was closer to flying on an airplane. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.